Hello. Welcome back. Uh, to Thief. Thief Gold. Thief's Dark Project. Thief One. Uh, where we have finally uh, reached the end. Supposedly. This is moving around. What you doing? very relatable, I find. Cats do that thing where they, they st if you've never seen them, they, they stand up and they stretch, you know, they look like they're getting up from a nap after they've been laying down, and then a lot of times they sort of do a little circle and then just plop right back down, and they're like, no, I'm not actually getting up. And, uh, I'm like, yeah, food. <laughs> Uh, God, where is the actual end of the stream here? Meeting the hammers, I think. We've got, <laughs> unfortunately, I have a few end of streams here. But, um, I believe we got down here and then came back up, and now we're here. Uh, because <laughs> there's a limited number of save slots in this game. Because it's, uh, I guess from that. Uh, you know, it's, it's enough that it's not like it's, uh... You know, this is not intended as a gameplay function, right? Like, this is, is pretty clearly a, um, uh, like a, I mean, I don't really know why, uh, games did this. I, you know, like, obviously it's like, oh, you had space constraints, but, like, who cares? That's, that's the user's responsibility to manage their space, right? So I'm not really sure why games do this. Like, oh, I guess... I mean, are they literally putting the saves into like a, what is this, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, yeah. Yeah, are they putting the saves into a, like a bit? <laughs> like, <laughs> they've got 16 slots? Like, yeah, or they didn't want to program a slow bar? I, I don't know. I bet because it's actually exactly 16. I bet it's literally... Uh, it, it's been put into a bit or something, and somebody was like, why would you ever need more than 16? Uh, which is, is extremely silly. Um, but, I was thinking about, because it made me think about, like, uh, Hitman in the original Hitman games. Uh, I, I guess, is this still the case in, uh, in, um, new, hit, in the, the Hitman trilogy, if you're on the hardest difficulty? Um, but the, they limited numbers of saves, you know, in a way that was like directly gameplay driven. Um, you know, on, on the hardest difficulty in the original Hitman's, uh, you had no saves. Uh, I mean, you had a save, you know, per mission, like for the mission. When you completed a mission, you would you would store that, but within a mission, you you couldn't save. Um, Yeah, I can't... I mean, I'm sure it wasn't necessary, PM, even when this game was made. Uh, but I, can, I have absolutely known programmers... Like, I know programmers now who are old programmers. Uh, you know, as I guess for people who don't know, I am a you know, professional programmer, so I, I work with a lot of programmers. And, and specifically, I work on a piece of software that, you know, is, is 25 years old. Uh, and so there are people on it who have been working on it from the beginning. And... Um, they are fuck. They will do this. They will like penny pinch, the uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, this like just the most ridiculous, you know, uh, things like this. They're like, dude, this is this is creating more work for yourself in the future. Like, uh, yeah, I mean, maybe it is a design thing. It just like it seems like it's so. I mean the the scroll bar thing also I can I can absolutely believe is they didn't, didn't set up a scroll bar they didn't have a scroll bar uh, like a scrollable control here I, I can absolutely believe that um, God it, I I I have to look up bitwise operators whenever I use them which is not very often um, they are. that that is actually I mean PM this is actually true because the same guy that, that 
pinches all this, you know, Penny pinches all the, the memory stuff, uh, is also a guy who is absolutely in love with, with flag enumerations, uh, which are all use bitwise operators, so yes, completely accurate. Uh, <laughs> uh, the flag enumerators are actually more useful. Uh, I understand that, uh, but... Uh, Alright, so let's restart to see the cutscene again. Reestablish, refresh. Stone cannot know why the chisel, chisel cleaves it. Uh huh. The iron cannot know why the fire scorches it. Excuse me. When they lie, uh, when thy life is cleft in scars from death and despair, leap at thee and beat not thy breast and curse thy evil fate. Thank the builder for the trials that shape. This was not the way things were supposed to go. I do think Constantine the, has the eye uh, and my eye. Like and the, I doubt the writing for this stuff, of like these little bits of you know the, the trickster is real. The hammer scripture or some of the other you know, I don't think anyone but those crazy folklore or other bits really we get in these in these cutscenes um, are mostly those really good. Crazy like hammers. they're very evocative. You know, it wouldn't hurt to have a few dozen styles of fanatics on my side just like about now. To if I drop by their temple you know, and explain the things, oh. maybe they'll be so distracted by the trickster's return that they'll forget to hold a grudge. And even if they don't, I know how to get out of Crag's cleft prison already. Right, we're going to beat the hammers because, uh, yeah, we, the wizard was actually, uh, uh, evil, like, the devil, the, the plant, the green man, you know, Loki, uh, some sort of primordial, uh, you know, wild chaos god thing, I guess. Um, you need to use the slag slur collision layers. Gives it pretty solid lore and vibes, certainly. Yeah. I mean, this one does, certainly. Um, slightly spooky, vaguely steampunk. It almost feels bad to me to call it steampunk, because I have such a, a negative, you know, an innate, neg I mean, not innate, but, you know, like, a, a learned uh, negative reaction to the idea of steampunk, um, which is, you know, there there is good steampunk, but I'm, I'm kind of like... Uh, you know, I almost want to call it something different, but but no, it, it does fit, um, and I and I think it is. I think it really works in this game. Um, yeah, this is before Steve O came in. I'm just probably. Uh, I mean, certainly in in the sort of like broad cultural sense, yeah. Uh, I mean, I mean, because I also think like, um, like I I don't think the difference engine is particularly interesting. I don't think the idea the actual original idea of steampunk uh, you know, if, if we associate it with a particular thing, obviously there's sort of retroactively stuff that gets grouped into it, but generally steampunk is associated with um, the difference engine the and, and the general idea of like the Babbage analytic engine sort of creating computers before computers, uh, you know, a Victorian computer era. And uh, honestly, I think like anything in that vein, I do not find interesting. Um, like this is almost really just like, it is like early, it, it's almost like rather than moving computers into the industrial era, right? This is like moving industry into like late medieval early modern you know like renaissance era is is more what it feels like what's going on here and that is something that i i'm generally more accepting of i guess um i've not really thought about this but but as i'm talking about it it makes sense um all seems clunky and fucked up we're dishonored all slick yeah i mean i really i like the dishonored setting broadly uh, as well but but it is an interesting 
difference that yeah even when you're you're pretty in dishonored both one and two you're pretty constantly in like places that are supposed to be like slums uh and, and you know shitty places and like they are nowhere near as as grimy or dirty as the places that they feel like here you know um and that's just an art direction thing um i think Everyone in this seems like kind of a dumbass. <laughs> I don't really have a sense of, like, people in this world at all. You know, like, like that is not something this game has given me. Uh, you know, we, we've met so few people and, and had so little interaction with people. Um, outside of, like, guards, I guess. Uh, so stay out of any fights. Maybe they have fights. You have to sneak past to talk to someone in charge. Yeah, yeah. So I'm going to load my save here, where I actually have my equipment picked out. Do we have... This is the same one, because we've already been here, right? Is, is that the deal? Um, I think so. Maybe not? I don't remember. I thought we had been here. I thought this looked familiar, but... I mean, we definitely stole from the Amorites and the body. Um, I think about steampunk now. It's interesting because like the uh, oh, what the? Why did I immediately get a new objective? Sneak into the Aber Priest and warn him about the Prefecture. Wait, huh? What did I find out about? I, I just walked down here. Why is it... Was that guy dead? This is definitely where I was before, right? I mean, there, there was the dead guy on the ground, but like, so what? Yeah, that's true, PM. I mean, I... Garrett doesn't come across to me as like the coolest dude around because of that stuff, but it doesn't feel like I guess there is a little bit of dialogue of like you know oh he's he's kind of a famous thief and he was maybe uh, I mean he was definitely you know like had special training right from the keepers uh, and then left and, and used it for deeper but he does just mostly seem like a guy like the stuff he gets his keeper training seems pretty uh, like not special I have a okay bad feeling about yeah they're this. they're all dead is that the I <laughs> just like I didn't see any I saw one body because uh, I immediately went down towards the sewers okay uh, yeah this seems like a bad time like we're in like the middle of the city and they just walked up on the temple and fucked everybody up I guess yeah you got a shadow meter yeah like I, yeah, I don't know if his is are his uh, like trick arrows supposed to be keeper stuff, but you know he buys those from like suppliers. So it can't be that uh, fancy. Uh, yeah, okay. Isn't this the? Right. Oh. What? How? Did, huh? Oh no, you can't. Okay. <laughs> it feels like it's doing a little squeeze move, like the the loading screen. Uh, you know, mo the the modern loading screen, but obviously not that. But uh, it's like ah, oh, here's here's a thin shaft. He's got to like do a little animation through. These aren't hammerites, right? Like these are like guards, like city guards. Is that what these are? You think 
Garrett's making his own special arrows then. He's just like Damn. buying the crystals. Looks like and, Constantine uh, got here before me. Alright, to Constantine. I guess let's start quick saving. This is cool. I mean, I love to, you know, revisit it. Oh my god, that. I didn't realize at first that was a broken window. I was like, what's going on with the texture? And then I turned and processed that. He's got to get him. He's got to get him without. Uh, he's got to get unregistered arrows, PM. You know, he's got to get him without the uh, <laughs> the licensing number on. <laughs> so they can't be traced back to him. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Uh, I hate this. I hate this. Yeah, the, the, the dwarf was, uh, yeah, free on Epic. Yeah. I don't have to, like, oh, I do. Okay, this is, co this is interesting. You have to, like, use the thing to get away the webs. Uh, using the like just like throw or like use item thing. It's like I can't change the selected item. God, I hate these things a lot. That's... No, arachnophobia mode. Oh, oh god, one of those fuckers. Different one. The hell's my regular arrows? Oh. Okay. That does work. It's just Jesus that takes a long time. Uh, it's like a bug plant monster. It shoots bugs at you like a swarm of insects. I don't know. Yes, there's there's a lot of magic. We spent half the game working for a wizard. Who turned out to be... Maybe the devil?
Well, Garrett's got, you know, devices that are maybe like Magitech kind of stuff. Unclear. Oh, good. Books. Did you and the devil have a good time? No. Uh, da da da. Who is it that has spoiled the work? The builder cast down his son and smite him with his hammer. Mistake may be mastered, but a lie lasteth forever on the tongue. Yeah, the devil took Garrett's eye. Stretches above the height of the man and lasted beyond the span of a man. Our greatest work to see us in all ways. And I hammer, what's I hammer in the morning? What's I hammer in the evening all over this land? <laughs> That's very funny. Uh, release me for I repent, shall do good old days. The master strike the thief's hand from him with a blade, and I said, Go now and do good, for thy repentance has been paid. Okay. Flaw in the gear will fade it to shatter. A flaw in the beam harbors the termite. A flaw in man's righteousness encompasses his death. The harlot said to the priest, Tarry a while, then wait upon thy duties. And the priest did tarry. Master Builder asked uh, thee to bless our brother who had died in service. Just la da da. I am a wall builder. Let my walls endure from season to season, year to year, and age to age. Let my walls stand while families toil, armies march, and empires fall. I am a wall builder, and my walls will stand always as a shield against evil. This I pray that the will the master builder grant. Walks for thee and builds for thee a fortress. Wilt thou go inside and shut the door? Wilt thou say yes? Now I shall raise one of mine own. I don't like these noises. Are they took from falsehood? Not really bodies in here like there were outside. Be not cautious, be correct. I was cold, thou taught of hearth and roof beam, and I was hungry, thou taught of pot and cauldron. To set by foes, thou taught of spear and shield, the hammer pounds the nail, holds the roof beam, the hammer strikes the iron, shapes the cauldron of the hammer in my hand, and then two my foes. Did we get anything? I don't think we got anything. No. Losing his eye doesn't seem to have affected his uh, accuracy with a bow, though. So. trying to open? I thought it was... Yeah, okay. That's what I was working on. When I got a spider. up. I don't remember layout-wise how we would get up. What, 
What are our objectives? Locate the hemorrhoids, okay. Yeah. Investigate the situation. This environment is really cool. Um, yeah, this is uh, revisiting. Uh, we've been in this temple before, but, uh, you know, before it was destroyed and everyone was killed. Uh, so we're, like, coming back to a, an earlier level, you know, but now it's changed, which is always a good time in a video game. Um, in addition to, uh, you know, simply uh, being, uh, you know, saving some, some labor time. There isn't, uh, there's not an upper part of the car, it only goes down. Um, right, I had forgotten how this works. Okay. Well, where should we go down? Go down to the front, which is obviously like the most obvious place to go down. It seems like it would be the most dangerous place, but also we're coming from one direction then versus like I don't want to drop down here, here there is a ladder but uh, we, we, please, please get back up that seems like uh, just putting myself in the middle which does not seem like a good time frankly I'm kind of curious about going out of side maybe go. oh god Come out at once! Oh hi, I didn't see you there. Looking like a weird rat. Well, actually, no, it's... their deal is. Are they monkeys? I don't know what the. Can't really tell. Back. Yeah, this is over here. It's up there. Okay. This is good. Let's poke around in here. These are what the novice quarters. Yeah, one of the novice quarters. I can't help but whenever whenever I see something like this in a game and I, I say a bottle, uh, I, I just, my brain goes to like a little bit in, um, in, in Bruges. Uh, where he says, a bottle! Uh, after they've had an earlier discussion about a, a bottle being a potentially deadly weapon. sound. I think that's another spider. I hate. Where are my regular arrows? Are they like somewhere? There they are. I got 30. Okay. I guess we're just at the stairs down at the front anyway. So we came from the side. We got those two guys, I guess, though. That was helpful. Um, let's go check out the like tomb area. We got the other novice quarters. I don't think there's anything in these chests. Yeah. A bowl. Some more bottles. Anything out here? I don't have to do the uh, 
puzzle again at least, I'm assuming. They are st it is still here. Of course. Cannot hold when the stone is not strong and clean. Okay. Bread. not knowing where it's coming from. down to like straight uh, perpendicular so oh he's another one I guess this is like the elders quarters right something like that I think I think this is where we had to break into last time uh, the high priest quarters no this is a storage room oh oh There's a healing potion in there, but not really anything else now. The high priest court is on the other side of this. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. We went into this room. We have not gone into... There it is. Thank God. That is... Is that a different kind of spider than the other one? Is that one not poison? That seemed weaker. Didn't do the, like, shooting thing the other one did. Yeah, I think this is the, like, elders, the high priest quarters. What are you trying to steal? Uh, we're not trying to steal anything on this mission. Um, we were trying, we were coming to try to contact the Hammerites, uh, even though they're, like, you know, law and order religious fanatics who hate Garrett, uh, because... You know, they they hate uh, the devil, and uh, we need some help. What is a tree but a tower that withers and dies? What is a pond but a cistern that stagnates and fills with muck? What is a patch of ground but a road which cracks and washes away? This is fascinating. This is the most interesting 
like a lot of the hammerite stuff i i appreciate and but it's like it's you know it, it is the sentiment is very generic sort of like you know uh just the same sort of moral stuff that you would expect but just in the language of you know through the metaphors of, of the hammer and building and all this stuff this is genuinely a, a like distinct sentiment right that is connected to uh the, you know that, that comes out of what their religion is about and, and it's very interesting uh to say what what yeah what what is a, a pawn <laughs> what is a what is a field but a a shitty road is is like that's a fascinating uh sentiment to express uh it makes sense for them um and i think that's that's a thing that's sort of been latent in the hammerite stuff so far but has not really been expressed is that they're kind of fundamentally a like um you know God wants us to be, to make ourselves better, uh, in the sort of, like, um, similar to, like, uh, like, Tolkien's, you know, Catholic perspective, where he was, like, you know, the, the thing that we should do to, like, glorify God is to create, uh, to create our own worlds, just like God did. Um, that's, that's what he wants us to do. It's like, you know, you, you should, uh, I mean, it's almost a, a kind of like, it's not a transhumanism, but it, it's a, a belief in, in the human ability to alter the world in, in, uh, ways that are, are better, basically, which is interesting. Yeah. I don't want me to bulldoze this grove and put up a party structure. Yeah, like that. Uh, it's like what if a what if a religion was sort of built around that uh, from you know first principles as opposed to sort of warped into that in the way that, uh, for example, um, you know Protestantism, uh, uh, Protestant Christianity was, um, which is kind of the you know the um, What's, uh, no, who is it? Who, who's the Protestant work ethic guy? Why can't I think of his fucking name? Um, you know, uh, the Protestant work ethic in the spirit of capitalism. Um, Weber? It's a Weber, right? Max Weber. Um, but that's kind of the like part of his argument is kind of like Christianity, like Protestant, Protestantism, kind of warps Christianity into a like. He's a little bit more positive about it, but um, you know, warps Christianity into a, a, a kind of distinct thing that is basically a religion of capitalism. Um, that that is. that it wasn't uh, in, in its other forms. Okay. Well, uh, I still hear noises that I don't like. Yeah, there's a way down to the next floor. Let's go quickly over here. I don't remember where this goes. Or where this is. Is this like... Yeah, I was going to say, is this leading to the... <laughs> the, like, fancy chamber? Yeah. This is where we got that relic that we actually stole from them. Uh, whatever that was. I don't remember now. It's like a little hammer. They have little hammers. It's like ritual objects. Uh, we've had a couple of those that we've used or stolen, I think. Um, okay. Let's just go down to the next floor. 
this is like the catacomb area. I mean, part of it's just a basement with storage, obviously, but like it is also catacombs. Uh, oh yeah, here's the like torturers. I, I think it's the Inquisitor. Yeah, the Inquisitor space. Uh, but, but he's the torturer. He's got like you know, torture instruments back here. The uh, right, the Iron Maiden. We talked about that uh, last time when I came to this. Here's the cells. They're not in the cells. Serpent, maybe? What? Oh, that's... That's caved in. Okay. I, I couldn't really tell in the darkness. It looked like it might just be a big creature with, like, a big, you know, gorilla-type thing with, like, a body on the bottom and a head up top, and I, I could not read what that was initially. Uh, this is going into the ritual chamber at the bottom. Or whatever we want to call this. The sort of sacred... Yeah, so nothing in here anymore, and I assume I don't need to get across the other side in this one. Usually read Inquisitor is torture. Yeah, that, that is a common um, meaning. But not universal. Not a lot of enemies here, which is concerning me. We had a handful and killed them. This is lower. This is like the the sort of new wine cellar or something that was being converted from the old like vault or something like that. process of like moving all their treasures hmm. here's where we were already yeah I mean this area is not actually that big so what am I missing where's the inquisitors there's no way to go back there's there's kind of like the long path yeah to the actual like catacombs right that's what was behind because I, I came into the Inquisitor's quarters the first time from the other direction uh, when I was here before. Um, but I think that's the path that was blocked off with the stone. So I don't think we can get into the actual like catacomb type area. Doesn't seem like it. So what am I missing? I guess... Oh. What the... Oh... Uh, yes. I have not been over here, and I missed this fucker. So yeah, I missed this. Somehow didn't... I did come in here. I guess I missed this particular hallway? No, I was in here. Okay, I just literally missed this room somehow. Didn't go quite far enough. Okay, but... Where? Hey, Mary. <laughs> uh, how overdue was that? Uh, it actually wasn't that overdue. It was only four days after I had subbed, so... Wow. Yeah, I know, like, uh, it was extremely unusual for Twitch. 
I, I, I was actually surprised. <laughs> uh, well, welcome. Oh, no, I, I was wrong. Sorry. It says sub anniversary in 26 days. My sub expires in eight days. I was wrong. <laughs> oh. Well, there you go. Uh, I saw the 26 days. I, uh huh. At first read as number of days left in the. Right. Um, yeah. Makes sense. But. So what's why is this place all fucked up? Uh, so this is you know we we're back at the Hamrai Temple where we like broke in before, and uh, we were coming here. Garrett was like, you know, I I need some help with this evil wizard devil green man problem. Gotta go to my enemies, the Hamrites. And uh, the the devil green man seems to have uh, gotten here first. This is back out the entrance. Everyone, well, they're actually, I haven't seen any hammerites. Just seen a lot of dead bodies of like guards and civilians. Um, and there were some, a couple of monsters that they killed. And everything's fucked up. That's new. Next. Uh, oh god, no, no. I. I think I caught it. Did I take damage there? I might have taken damage there. Okay. I do have to go down here. This is the area that was cut off. I think. Couldn't get in here from the other direction. Oh, good. What is that? Oh, that's one of those guys. That's fine. That's more of those guys. <laughs> I forgot this is a game where you cannot hold the arrow indefinitely. Where'd it go? It's hard, hard on your limbs to hold that arrow. I mean, yeah, the, that's completely uh, not a thing a person can do, but in video games you tend to be able to do that. Yeah. Uh, nobody's now. Unless you're one of those people that's like, I'm gonna download the Oblivion Skyrim mods where your stamina drains while you're holding a bow. I don't know who did that, though. Started, now we're seeing ham rights. Oh, hey, buddy. What sword was... Uh, how is he walking? From... Okay. Serious sword set here. Yeah, I feel like the sword hitbox is bigger than it looks. Uh, I just haven't usually had it where I'm hitting their sword from behind. You know, usually being behind them has been, uh... Uh, pretty solid. <laughs> to be fair, these guys' models are much different than the yeah, humans yeah, you mostly dealt with. Right. Yeah. Fuck. Stop it! No, this is rude. You're getting up on me. One v one, me bro. One v one. Oh God! Fuck. Okay, that is that is a different spider. Yep, you stay there for- No, fuck! 
This is a very funny mechanic that was happening at the start of the stream. Uh, it webs you and it basically force equips a stack of items you have to throw away. One by one. Oh, that's clever. Okay. Uh, was that some? That's a chisel. Okay. Yeah, that's probably necessary. Maybe. Hey, buddy. Ah! I've been owned. A lot of light in these tunnels for being pretty dark. I have no idea how the like <laughs> I don't understand how the enemy sword fighting AI works. Uh it's not really a complaint though. Alright, what am I uh, I'm location unknown, yeah. Pretty lost. Oh, that's a dead one of these guys. I didn't kill that guy. Alright. I hope that means there's hemorrhoids nearby. There's a guy. Spider. Okay, I just didn't come back this way, I guess. But I assume I go down here. like a single living hammerite? Nope. Not a one, huh? Okay. Uh, that's the objective. Hmm. Don't kill any hammers feels like it's a real easy uh, objective to finish. <laughs> Oh, goodbye. Wow. That was less falling damage than I thought. Except now he just hit me with this shit, yeah. I saw that guy. I wasn't saying anything about him because I'd hope I was hoping he'd just hop into you. Uh oh. Uh, where do 
where a friend to go. Probably directly below you. Oh, that would be preferable. That's that was what I was more worried about. Oh, this is this is all bad. Whatever the fuck is going on here. Oh god. Here comes the hoppy boy! Ooh, nice shot. I don't know which way is. Nope. I don't think this is the way either. Well, maybe. Okay. Oh god. There's no way you're hitting that frog. Don't bother. Uh, let's see here, where's, do I have any? I don't have any fire arrows. Great. I stabbed one of these bug guys to death earlier, and he took like, I don't know, like five <laughs> hits or something. Like, I was just continually hitting him for a while from behind. What's your chisel used for? I don't know. I just picked it up. <laughs> no, come back here. I'm stuck on a corpse or something. <laughs> Their walk is so... <laughs> They look like they're painfully <laughs> stepping. Okay, that many hits. Yeah, that's what I figured. Gotta find the key. Yeah. Alright, I'm out of healing, but do seem to have killed everything outside of maybe a few stray frogs. So, I think I'm doing okay. This guy's got some weird little environmental thingies. Nothing, okay. This one has a, also a way down, maybe? Oh, spiral. It's got a weird, you know, just room out in the stars. I do like that they do this stuff. There's a water room, okay. So there's a space room, a water room, a... Uh, looks like there's water arrows in there. Anything else? No, I like that there's like a water surface on that. Within the water. Interesting. Uh, so let's go down here, I guess. Is this different? Oh, there's a hammer, right? OK. 
Okay. Looks like that's maybe the catacombs I was trying to get into. Nothing else down here though, maybe. Oh, there okay. we go. Yeah, you finally found one. Do you have mic issues? Uh, yeah, I just got uh, slightly unplugged from my headset. Gotcha. Uh, and then here's the other spiral staircase. Let's see. Oh, hey! Ah, tis thee, the master thief. There is scant time to explain. The trickster's foul beasts hath captured our high priest, and if we cannot retake him alive, all shall be lost. We lack thy skills of stealth and treachery, and our enemies must surely kill him should we make a bold attempt. Take this key and map and go. May the builder uh, uh. guide your steps. That guy's voice change? Yeah. Okay. Don't know what was up with that. I spied one who may be escaped prisoner. Uh oh, it's a new map. Uh Okay. I don't know where now. Like, I guess I have a key. Oh, I have a key to the door at the top, right? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Which was the way up? Pop a save? Yep. Oh, yeah, you. Fine. Sorry. <laughs> Take a sword to it, just in case. <laughs> oh. Big D mouse. Oh, there's a guy behind you. Uh, sorry, I meant in the door to like. Ah, yeah, that guy. Bloody spells. What? Fuck! 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 I have been alerted by the fact that there was a corpse there. Yeah, I thought as long as he couldn't see me, or he hadn't seen me, that I could still get him, but I'm not sure. I don't remember. Arr, go away! Where the fuck did uh, you go? Well, it went away! Just like you asked! <laughs> to like turn around and then stand there.
Uh, okay. Could I not hit it? Oh my god, it's still not dead. Fuck off. God damn it. God damn it. Piece of garbage. Why the fuck do you... How dare you? How dare you? This looks like it'd make a good escape route for me and the high priest. <laughs> oh god! Hi guys! God damn it. Extremely hoisted. I just want to kill the spiders. Who's there? I'm hitting the side of the thing. God, they take so much to kill! Alright, do I have anything else? I guess I have a regular mine. I did kill it. I'm happy. Works for me. Alright. That thing's dead. That guy. Hey, buddy. Ow. Thought maybe you wouldn't see me. Alright, yep. just came out of nowhere. But now he's down. There are too many rooms here.
are both chasing each other and utterly lost. dead on this floor. Alright, in this weird thing. So yeah, there's... Go down here. This looks like it'd make a good escape route for me and the high priest. Oh, through on the raft. I did not process. That's what he was talking about last time. No, come back. <laughs> Shit, why is it leaving again? Oh, is that, is that just what it does? It just goes back and forth. Touch this. I have no idea what. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna reload before I. T no, I've already saved. God damn it. Uh, please. I'm confused. I'm just gonna have to hope that I can use that. There's a lot of guys here, huh? Shit. I did 
down and get it. deal with you. The guy? That did not work. Uh, where are the guys? I don't even know where I went now. Oh, over here. Keep hiding, and still find you. I hope. Was it ne right next to where I... Okay, it was. Pick 
guy up again. There he is. I hope it's coming back. Slain, let your wrath fall on mercy. Hey guys, uh, so I need to get your raft or something. way uh, okay 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 we're okay I was like I don't think I can swim with that guy so it seemed like it was gonna be an issue Okay, here he is. Two ways they do both go up. Okay, okay. So then, let's go... Wherever that other exit was. I think I'll be able to find it. This guy's not dead, I can't really tell. But I'm assuming he's not. There it is. Okay. 
zero loot. I didn't see any. The weights in each pan of the balance had increased greatly. As he approached his triumph, our foe had made himself vulnerable. That always the way. We were unable to directly influence him, we could only watch and wait. To see whether he was pridefully dressed on or in his Ain't Well, that this is it. The hammers say they've received word that Constantine's descended into his realm to perform a ritual with the eye. The hammers have built me a booby-trapped counterfeit eye. If I can swap it for the real thing, it should cause him some trouble. If he doesn't notice me. I've never robbed a god before. It'd be a challenge. You don't like Garrett's voiceover? Keepers tell you that Constantine's gone into the Maw of Chaos. You get to go in after him. You can swap the fake eye the Hammerites made for the real eyes using the ritual. That should put a damper on his plans. Well, as long as we put a damper on his plans. Oh, no, no quick. Oh my god, okay. Come through a portal into. Great. What, what do we actually have as far as. Okay, we've got a bunch of arrows. Regular arrows. We have a water arrow, a fire arrow, a moss arrow, a gas arrow, five rope arrows, five noisemaker arrows, and we have a papyrus, a compass, a fake eye, gas, two gas mines, too. Oh my god, there's a lot of. I don't need to read this papyrus. Dost this help thy art? Yeah, the backing tracks are funny to me. I don't, I don't find the voiceover cheesy. Um, but the yeah, the, the music in the cutscenes is very funny. Uh, where thee the rock of crystal, the song of doom. The heart of mortal man is weak against its siren call and temptation beckons. As where thou drawest, the rock waits until thy heart is close for its strike and thy fate is sealed. Tis a fragment found in an old record warning of the maw. Okay, I don't, I don't know what that means, but I'm sure we will. Oh, they're leaving. They're just leaving, huh? Okay. Well, that's fascinating. Uh, I'm actually going to get a brick. going somewhere. It's nice that we're getting um, into the spring uh, towards summer because Dio likes to go sit on the couch and uh, now not really, you know, he's got his seasonal spots and 
and uh, for some reason he's like really perturbed by the green screen so if he's in in this room when I put it up he always he always immediately runs away uh, Rosa does not give a shit There's like the gate. Um, animated lights are a nice touch. The PM is like a Doom level. Um, yeah, I mean, I I I like. It is always fun when. Oh God. Oh. Oh, those are the the fucking. I forgot about those guys. I also didn't realize how similar they are to the, the bug guys. Makes sense. Uh, oh, these guys are like. Are they at least the army going out? They're gonna be continuing to go out there. So I just need to stay put for a second. Um, I always like, you know, when it's like uh, the sort of like here's the established geometry, you know, and then and then like something breaks that geometry. Obviously, we had that earlier with like Constantine's mansion in the first place. Um, but uh, I think about like the end of System Shock 2, uh, you know, another. Uh, in, in this same lineage, right? Um, and uh, I think the... Uh, I mean, that game has, has some other environmental changes before then that are also fun, but uh, I think the ending of that game is very cool. Um, it does make any fucking sense, plot-wise, you know, like as, as a thing that's happening, uh, but it, it looks cool as hell. That guy's Descending, I guess. Eve <laughs> 2 is overall great. Uh, it has fewer opportunities for insane high level geometry like this. The is magical. Well, this stuff is cool. Oh god, never mind. This guy wants to kill me. Um, this stuff is cool. Uh, I think I would be fine with that trade, though, to be honest. Um, uh, in an overall game, if there's no fucking zombies. and mechanical enemies. Okay, I don't know if I like that as a trade-off. Uh, I mean, traps are... I don't know. Maybe fine. Mechanical enemies sounds bad. It sounds like zombies with a different name in terms of how they would function. Although I suppose they're probably more... Uh, I assume they're easier to avoid. That's part of the problem I have with zombies in this game, is they feel very unpredictable, um, which is weird. <laughs> I've said that before. Uh, it seems like they should be perfect in stealth enemies, but... Fucking medieval security cameras. Have we seen those in this game? I feel like we've maybe seen something like that in this game. Okay, now he did, because... 
as the lighting here is really... I thought this was in shadow, and it's... I want my treasures. guys shooting at me, but I don't know what I was... Okay. It also made it sound like you have to be stealthy here, like you can't get caught, which I'm sure is not true. Um, but it is interesting. I think he's facing toward me? I can't tell. Alright, now he's definitely not, though. Fuck. There we go. Did it see me? I think it saw me. Can't pick these guys up. It seems like that's interesting. Oh, did I save at the? I guess I don't really need to, but Maw of Chaos will make a hard save. Just have one. Okay, not this path, huh? What is... What the fuck is that? I see. Fascinating. That's interesting. The, like... Dainty footstepping of the the bug monsters, yeah, it's, it's very funny to me. Right, it's good. I don't know how to describe that. You know, they're just doing that like real high step. Okay. What 
the music from the uh, the Halo Law was playing for this. Crystals. France. That's a good. One. Oh God. <laughs> Can you not actually like hit things with this? <laughs> Don't explode on me. Damage from something, and I have no idea what it was. I... Well, let's not try that again. Let's not do that again. Oh god. Well, I only have one water arrow. Interesting. Oh, there's a bubble. Yeah, more uh, bubbled enemies. Bubbles. Uh, is this back the way that I came? I don't think so. Still going down. I was wondering if I was gonna have to drop off there. Oh god. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. I'm going down, I guess. On the ice. Oh. Uh. And water up there. I do like that they, uh, you know, they're able to use these <coughs> stuff to the boat. mind. I don't want to go down to the bottom. I guess I do want to go up. I thought I was going to, like, be trying to, you know, stagger myself and drop to the bottom without dying. Which I didn't succeed in doing, but it doesn't seem like there's anything down there anyway, so... doesn't like take me back to the top or I don't know I mean, hope this is forward progression well I was hoping to get some air there all right there's some air yeah, I wonder how much this is just level designers playing with weird physics and stuff and then building a plot around it. Um, I would love to know. I think I think certainly some of it, right, was like, you know, what what are the weird shit we could do in the engine? Yes and no. I guess I can... Oh god, can I get in the middle? Okay. And there we go. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, so where am I now? Okay, big tree. Love a big tree. 
Now that's big. Now that's a big tree. Yeah, we did talk about their PM. Very funny. Go to sleep. Uh, do I need rope arrows for this? One? Oh, we have nobody who. like a little light with some stuff coming out of it, like a bug or something, but not, uh, okay, here we go, oh, god, great, great, love it, <sighs> spider zone, huh, of course it is, of course it's the fucking spider zone, every shot I don't actually know like where the arrow goes how am I missing every fucking shot they're all grouped together okay I hit one of them Jesus Christ oh they're okay they're really weak spiders I guess Or maybe I was hitting them? It just wasn't showing? Yeah, I think that might have been what was happening. I mean, there's only some of these that I missed. But... Okay, there's a lot of arrows over here. Uh, that's good though. It's good. Oh, is so that's is that loot? That's fruit. Okay. Just like a a very small health refresh, I think. Yeah. Can't jump. You're you're falling. It's uh not cool games. How the fuck do I get up from here? Well I'm definitely not high enough for that. Uh oh rope, I guess. The thing the famous thing in this game. Uh that uh Love this game's sound design, stumbling into these different random ambient sound fields. Yeah. Uh. Uh, ah. Uh, I can't tell. Uh, well, okay, there we go. That's like, is there something here? 
the geometry. This is one of those things where the the geometry, the textures are so simple that it, it's hard to get a good sense of how things work, uh, which is kind of fine, um, especially in the Mall of Chaos. Uh -oh. that just like go through also where the, the fuck did it hmm. not trying to look at my weird papyrus I don't know what that means still I'm sure it will play a role King spiders why are there spiders Or like, do spiders have a head? It must be some spiders just take have less health, right? Or something. Oh god. Hi, Dio. This is the way forward, and I can just ignore that one. Interesting. <laughs> Does this, uh... supposed to be. Uh, so we're... I have no idea if this is... I'm assuming this is... new. 
that we're back in the lava zone. be discovered. thought to check if we had a map. Uh, I just assumed we didn't. Uh, and we don't, but we have this, which I guess this has actually been updating in terms of it's highlighting this, so that's the big tree. That's the water, I guess. The ice? Stairs? Uh, so I guess we are, you know, we're below the big tree, we're in the lava, uh, I guess we're getting close-ish, presumably, uh -huh. don't know, uh, okay, well, I mean, passageway down here, and then a place going off. What's that over there? Weird platform. The lava lake. I don't think that's anything. It's interesting. Let's. assumed that they, they, those, you know, the chaos creatures were in the Maw of Chaos, aren't they just kind of like bubbling up out of the primordial chaotic? Uh, I don't like this. They're like, gonna get fucking eaten. These look like barnacle <laughs> thingies to me. Ah, uh, hey buddy. Is, is he just a fucking, like, satyr? The Maw of Chaos Center? Question mark. The, the Eye of the Maw? Oh, hi, Rosa. 
So here we really need to not get seen. I assume he's going to turn around. Green and curl, chokes and bind, leaves and furl, thorns his spine, tumble wall, leak in mind, cut it all. Leafy's mine, call the vine, call the green, brings the fall, whirl, leave you still. You didn't see me, right? Wow, that doesn't give you a, uh, like... <laughs> I just... Send you right to the menu, it doesn't give me the, the chance to hit the load button. Do you have to do all of these? We're waiting a long time. Storm black and blow, swirly gust, rain winds blow, pushing dust, storm clouds grow, doxy clouds, Did we get the real eye? Throw, is it our inventory? It is. Call the storm, call the gray, bring thee forth, world's old way. There, uh, I made for complete as ritual. Is there, like, things up above? I'm curious if I can go up to the side and get up those. Flame burning heat, fences charred, lazy sheet, black and tar, man flesh meat, melting gears, dance and leap, man fool's beer, come to reap, call the pack. <laughs> Okay, I guess there's not really anything up here, but we get a better view, maybe. Tide rise and fall, river flood, rain and squall, churning mud. Dam break all, sea waves wash, swampy squall, yes. sewer slosh, drain pipe stall, call the wave, call the blue, bring thee forth world anew. Shake, brink a pile, chip and flake, dotty soil, windows break, earthy toil wall and make, call earth, call the brown, brings a back world thrown down. It's a good thing the Hammerites were able to uh, create a fake eye so quickly, I guess. Seems like it'd be difficult to do. A fake version of an artifact that can fool. Night smother light, this guy. Blood break lamp done with bright, do and damp, smother tight, dark and high, fools he sight. Stay inside, fear the night, call the dark, call the black, brings he forth, I call it back. 
Yeah, I think he does have different poems for each one. <laughs> Incantations. Open for me. Open to me. Open my way. Open the path. Open for me. Open. It betrays me. Okay. Oh. I just hadn't, I was like, I've been waiting for a while, but I hadn't quite waited long enough. I just saved the world, yourself included. As we knew you would, as it had to be. Now I remember why I left the Keepers. And I remember why we let you go. What do you want from me? Have you come to congratulate me? Welcome me back to the fold? Very well. I will speak my piece plainly. You have accomplished that which was written, and yes, you've done it well. But there is no place for you with us any longer. Yet you will have a great need of us, and soon. I don't think so. I'm through with heroics, and with your kind as well. You cannot run from life as you did from us, Garrett. Life has a way of finding you, no matter how artistic a sneak you are. Listen, there is a book that you were not made aware of. I am here to tell you that it would be wise for you to read it now. But you can still read hieroglyphs. I do try to forget, but you keepers leave them everywhere for me. Yes. You have more friends than you know. Tell my friends that I don't need their secret book, or their glyph warnings, or their messengers. Tell them I'm through. Tell them it's over. Tell them Garrett is done. I will tell them this. Nothing has changed. All is as it was written. The trickster is dead. Beware the dawn of the Metal Age. <laughs> okay. What a fucking sequel, geez. Uh, the title of Thief 2, of course, is the Metal Age, right? Hello. I don't like prophecy shit. Uh, uh Garrett being some kind of chosen one. Fuck that shit. Uh, it's also weird in this game. I mean, I guess we're the the implication is that the sequel is gonna deal with this, uh, but that like. Uh, I guess not. Uh, uh, what was I gonna say? Um, with the the hammerites being like, you know, framed obviously pretty negatively. Uh, of course, this game is just kind of these, 
you know, religious zealots, uh, sort of, uh, a certainly very hardline, you know, authoritarian, sort of vaguely, whatever, you know, <laughs> vaguely, you know, bad order signifiers, and then, like, uh, you know, actually, the, the real villain is, uh, you know, the, the chaos, the, the untamed wilds, uh, the, um, and, uh, you need the Hammerite's help, even if it's like, oh, but really it's the Keepers who are, feel very druidic, you know, in terms of D&D druids, they, they feel very, like, uh, the Harpers, they feel very, like, true neutral, um, at least in this game, um, and, uh, uh, which is all fine, other than just, it, it's weird to have, yeah, kind of this, this genuine, uh, sort of force of evil, uh, coming from something outside of this, I guess, um, kind of validating those, those worldviews, anyway. Uh, but presumably, at least for the, as far as the Hammerites are concerned, uh, yeah, it sounds like with the defeat of, of you know, uh, the devil that, uh, you know, I think he's going to then go back in the other direction to too much, uh, which also honestly sounds kind of silly, but, um, regardless, uh, that's Thief, I guess, uh, really interesting game, obviously a very, uh, important game, and it merits its importance historically. But uh, what a messy game, also, as much as it's got a lot of really cool stuff, it's got a lot of really frustrating stuff uh, that it doesn't work, or, or, you know, it seems like some not great ideas all the time, but it's a lot of good ideas, a lot of really cool ideas, so. Starting Thief 2 next week, no. Uh, nope. Uh, I mean, one next week would be uh, Make Aquarium again. Um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know what I'm playing next. I'll look at my games list. Um, but I'm not going to... I don't think we'll make a decision here, but I could definitely look. I can mark Thief. It's done. Uh... There's some other stuff. Uh, might do something shorter to just get through some stuff. We'll see, though. Uh, but regardless, it would be in two weeks, like I said. Um, whatever it is. We'll see, though. Uh, but, uh, yeah, for now, I don't know. I don't, don't think I have anything else uh, to say. Uh, I think we've, we've talked a lot about Thief over the course of these streams. Um, and uh, I think Mary's still away, unfortunately. Hopefully everything is fine with her. Um yeah, thanks everybody uh, for joining for Thief. Uh, this is a fun, I mean, it's fun to stream, uh, even when it was frustrating, I think. Um, uh, I did have a, you know, a good time broadly. So let's see here. I haven't actually updated my schedule because I got to get Thief off. I got to get Tomb Raider off. Um so yeah this is kind of maybe not as helpful but uh tomorrow i will be uh streaming death stranding um we made a bunch of main story progress last time that was interesting some was very frustrating some was uh very fun but uh hopefully we can continue to make some progress and then uh sunday like i said i gotta update this we Tomb Raider Legend, uh, we finished last Sunday, uh, we'll be starting Dune 2, um, the battle for Arrakis, uh, or the building of a dynasty, 
depending on uh, which which region you were in. Um, <laughs> Uh, so that will be on Sundays. Continue going through Dune games. Um, back on to that for however long Dune 2 takes, which may be a while. Um, Dune 1 was not that long. I, I feel like Dune 2 is going to be a bit longer, and they're going to get longer for a while <laughs> for the next couple of uh, games. But um, that's that. And then, like I mentioned, uh, next Friday will be uh, Mega Quarium again, uh, as far as I know. Um, so we somehow not done with that expansion. We are moving through it so slowly, but it's a fun time. Uh, stop by for that. Uh, you can follow channel for notifications when I go live. You can, uh, follow the Twitter account on there for tweets when the stream goes live. Uh, you can follow the YouTube channel for VODs. You can sub to the channel, the, the Twitch channel, uh, for emotes, um, and uh, I think that's about it. So thanks everybody for watching again and uh, hope to see you again in the future. Have a good night.